Man, this character terrifies me. Yeah, this is one of those characters that uh, it's hard to say if he's like weak or strong. He's just like he's just kind of there, but he's he definitely he's got has, some tricks. Yeah, he definitely has a lot of tricks, especially with that V trigger too. Um, oh my gosh! He can kind of do a Blanca ball, maintain that pressure, get some good damage. No swinging in between. Yeah. So it's one of those characters that I feel like, even though he's not top tier, you do have to prepare for this character. You gotta know. You definitely have to know. Because you will get gimmicked out if you're not sure what to do. All right, big jump in right there. Goes for the Blanca ball. I like the answer back. The double Tatsu. All right. Walking him back to the corner already. All right, and uh. Good spacing from Tokido right there. He wants to be, um, he knows that Blanca players like to jump. So he wants to stay at a space where he could comfortably throw fireballs and still be ready to enter with a DP. Just classic Shoto spacing right now. I like the crosscut DP right there from Tokido. He already knows. And Gran Todakai, that's the, I, I, I recognize the name, so it might be someone pretty good from this region. All right, he needs to do a little better in this first round right now. Oh no, there's the activation. Okay. Oh, okay, this is what we've been talking about. Straight for it. He can definitely die right now. He can definitely die. And look at that. He stays right next to you after that sequence. And plus... Oh, the same side. Wait oh. a minute. Wait a oh, minute. Oh, no. It's Tokido, bro. It was Tokido. You got a little too out of you got a little too out of pocket right there. You better chill. And Tokido was like, nah, man. Your, your setup's got to be more real than that because I will test you with the jab. One of the strengths of Akuma has a three-frame long-range jab. Oh, the coward. All right, and uh, Gran Todakai didn't look too bad, though. He could have definitely stole that round. He definitely could have stole that round. Imagine if he had got one or two more hits, activated that trigger a little later, and we would have been talking about a different game. All right, so he definitely has Tokido on his toes right now. All right, nice jab ball right there, Blanca ball. I like, oh, that jump in. Oh, wow, making good reads on these jumps. He's landed a couple of those. Oh, wow, walk up overhead. Rock. Break that rock. And both of them sitting on a lot of meter. Gran Todakai has the full stick of butter right now. Nice pressure right there. Ooh. Okay, okay. Oh, the jump in. Grand oh. Total Kai and the crowd wakes yeah. up instantly. And a pretty dominant round right there. He looked pretty comfortable. He walked them down, um, mixed in some Blanca balls right there, jab ones, which are safe. Kuma can't punish those. I like the Blanca win pop off. That, that is definitely a tasty deep pop off. You just got to yell. Yep. Little, little throwback right there. And I like the range that, that Total Kai is staying at because. If he's able to react to the fireballs uh, well, he could just slide under them. Um, he could jump in. So it definitely is, is putting Tokido has to be hyper aware of the situation and react to things accordingly. Well, you could tell it has him second guess and throwing some of those fireballs because a bunch of his damage, his round yeah. came from the fact that he was able to call a good jump in. Here's the activation on the trigger. Good poise by Tokido just to stand there and break the throw. He tried to go for a throw again. And look at the damage output. Still has one more. We saw last time he did the block a ball, went for the low state in front. But nice first jab check. This see. might kill. Ugh. Yo, oh, still just alive. barely. I'm still Magic alive. pixel. But no more V trigger for Grand Todakai. All right, plus. Gets the throw. Okay, and, and he. And Check him. Yeah, Tokido has been checking a lot. So that's something that Grand Todakai has to be aware of. That Tokido is willing to check almost every time. So maybe Todakai has to maybe mix him some meaty, uh, heavy attacks to get those crush counters. Um, just kind of keep Tokido honest. Make him want to not press buttons on wake up. Uh, but uh, overall, not a bad uh, first game. Um, Dude, he's doing really well. Like, yeah. we don't get to see a lot of Blancas, you know? That's what you should do next. You should do Blanca Tech next. I'm going to be waiting. Right. But, yeah, he's one of those characters that, like, one, we talked about people not knowing matchups, but we also talked about people not knowing characters. I think Blanca is the one of the perfect examples of those characters, especially with Trigger 2, like you said. Yep. And one of the things that uh, makes Blanca different in this version is that in, in the older Street Fighter games, his Rainbow Ball wasn't really that good, especially the normal one. Uh -huh. But in this one, the, the, the difference in the arcs is much bigger. So it's hard to tell at the last moment which one they did. And they're, they're plus now. So like yeah, it actually gives them a good way to get in with a little bit of chip damage. Do you see how he's using these Blanca Balls to move around? Yeah. Get damage has a slight life lead right now. Or he had one. Here yeah. comes Tokido. Yeah, but it's definitely Tokido's not the type of player that you could just spam stuff on, so he has to be he does have to be careful um, doing it too much. These are the exact same situation that we saw before. Tokido keeps reacting the same and it's definitely gotten him in a lot of damage. However, here we go. Activates trigger of his own. In the shimmy and goes for the heavy DP for the hard knockdown setup. Oh, oh. Poor throw. He needs something right now. He can't chip him out just yet, but it's coming. Tries to get the slide, he was definitely going to activate. Yeah, he wants that slide into V-Trigger. I'm pretty sure he can kill with an exchange, but he gets hit by the DP on the jump in. Yeah, if he, if he could have got a clean trigger combo, he probably could have took the round. Yeah. But if he played it correctly. 
Maxwell right now. Oh, oh up overhead. That was interesting. That's the second time he's done it, too. Nice check with the medium kick. Red fireball on top of it. You can see Tokido trying to get him to this corner. All right, but uh, Tokido still looks pretty comfortable right now. And that's a, a, a string that you'll see in Season 4 Akuma players doing now. They do the standing medium kick into the light red fireball because they sped up the light red fireball. So now it's like a, a string that you can't push buttons in between. Oh, uh, okay. Let's see if he goes for the jumping combo. Good awareness right there. Oh, he could have got a lot more than that. Yeah, he dev and he even did the jump and everything. I yeah. thought he was about to do some big boy damage. Yeah, he just wasn't ready for it. It's one of those things that I was like, you probably didn't expect Tokido to get a, do a DP. Come right. on now. Can't give these players too much credit. All right. And now you see Grand Total Kai trying to change up that angle that he's coming in. Tokido swung, and now he's got to think about it. He's at small life lead. Oh, no activation there. Maybe a little bit of nerves. Oh, oh he went for the cross-up. And this is what I was talking about. Like, all it takes is one smooth opening. And a character like Blanca can kill you. Still has two bars. This is only the second game, and it's not over yet. This is set point for Tokido, however. So a little bit of a, a sleep at the wheel Tokido was there because um, when... Blanca does the the Blanca bow into the extension. Um, there's only a gap if he does a cross up, so you could just always hold forward to block the cross up. But uh, you know, Tokido just kind of probably forgot about that in that moment. Um, got hit with the cross up and lost a round, but uh, good opportunity oh, here the for Grand Total Kai. Scratch him in the face. Ex. Uh oh, wait a minute. Oh. Gets the cross up stun is becoming a factor right now. Oh, and let's see if he's able to get it in. Oh, oh nice jab check there. Side switch is going to knock that stun bar all the way down and give Tokido a chance. Wake up, rainbow ball, not going to work. CA is on deck. And now it's going to be a mix-up with the with the demon. Oh, all right, uses the meter, doesn't need it. He can definitely kill right now. A successful hit, a bad call. Oh, yo, just hit, walked forward and hit medium kick. That yeah, could have been worse, but... uh. Another chance for Grand Totokai. Uh oh, nice the slide. slide right there. That looked like it was psychic. It was before the fireball even came out. Uh -huh. All right, Totokai is trying to say that. Crowd getting hyped. Right. His people wanted to stay alive, wanted to make it 1 1. Let's go, Totokai. Oh, look at, look at, oh, they walk it back and forth. All right. 23 seconds left look, on the clock. Look at Tokido's meter, though. No, you've been doing that since the first game. You should have known Tokido was going to be ready. Those, the jump ins over the fireballs stop becoming effective in that second round. He yeah. always was like, okay, you got a round off of me based off of it, but now I'm going to start DPing more, spinning the meter this time, going to get him the W Tokido. Not unfamiliar at all. Yeah. Not unfamiliar at all. Tokido going to take that set 2-0. Man, yeah, the grand total, Kai, though. Yeah, yeah, he did pretty good. He, he took Tokido to the edge right there. And 